Hello everyone, this video is about algebraic expression, the terminologies in algebra. So what is algebraic expression? It is a variable, a constant, or a combination of both which may be related by any of the four fundamental operations. And 3x squared minus 8xy plus 5 is an example of algebraic expression. Now, let me discuss the different terminologies that you will encounter in our lesson. First is the constant. It is a number with a fixed value. Constant term. It is a number with a fixed value and does not contain any variables. Variable, it is a letter which holds a place open for a number. Term, it is a constant, a variable, or a product or quotient of a constant and variables. And it is separated by the symbol plus and minus. Numerical coefficient, it is a constant factor in a monomial. Literal coefficient, it is a variable factor in a monomial. So to understand it further, let's have an example. For example, we have 3x squared minus 8xy plus 5. In this given, the constant is 3, negative 8, and 5. Because a constant is a number with a fixed value. Siya yung number na makikita mo sa isang algebraic expression at huwag kalimutan na kasama doon ang kanyang sign, kung positive ba or negative. How about the variable? So when we say variable, it is a letter which hold a place open for a number. So in this given, the variable is x and y. So the answer is, x and y. Wag nating ilalagay yung x, x, y ha, since we are just looking for a letter. So, x and y lang ang isusulat mo. Next is the constant term. So, since we are referring to a constant term, it is a number with a fixed value and does not contain any variable. So, pag sinabi natin constant term, Number siya na walang kasamang letter. So, the answer is 5. Now, how about number of term? So, pag sinabi natin term, it is separated by plus or minus. So, ilang terms kaya ang makikita sa given na ito? So, 1, 2, 3. So, therefore, there are 3 terms in this given. Next is the numerical coefficient. So, pag sinabing numerical coefficient, it is a constant factor in a monomial. So, that is 3 and negative 8. So, ang dapat mo lang tandaan pag sinabing numerical coefficient, number siya na may kasamang letter. Now, how about the literal coefficient? Again, when we say literal coefficient, it is a variable factors in a monomial. So, the answer is x squared and xy. So, tandaan, ito yung letter na kasama pati ang exponent ha. At ang titingnan mo dyan ay yung bawat term ng isang given. So, the answer is x squared and xy. Now, let's have another example para mas maintindihan natin. So, for example, we have 2x squared y plus xy minus 4. And we are going to identify the following. So, what is the constant in this given? Yes, 2, 1, and negative 4. So, remember, kapag ang isang term ay wala kang nakikitang number o constant, meron niyang 1. That's why our answer is 2, 1, and 
negative 4. Now, what is the variable? Correct. It's x and y. So, again, when we say variable, it is a letter that can be found in a given algebraic expression. Next is the constant term. So, what is the constant term in this given? Yes, it's negative 4. How many terms are there? There are 3 terms. So, 1, 2, 3. Now, how about the numerical coefficient? So, it is 2 and 1. And the literal coefficient is x squared y and xy. Now, it's your turn. Complete the given table using the given algebraic expression. So, if you are my student, please answer it in your notebook. If not, try to answer it and write it in the comment section. Next lesson, polynomials. Thank you for watching. Happy learning everyone!